Tactical time. Alright. I have played this a few times. But for the sake of the viewer, let's do a two- It is important to protect your hero characters at all costs. Alright, so this game basically is a sequel to the Third Age. Came out a year after and came out on the PSP, the PlayStation Puny. Borrows a lot of assets from Third Age. And don't you worry, I'm gonna point all of them out. So if you were here just for the Third Age content, well then, you're gonna love this. There's gonna be Third Age references every bloody five seconds. Yep. Where's the body square? That took very long, maybe that's an emulator issue. Because I'm playing this on a PPSSPP emulator. It's for a PSP. The frame rate looks pretty fucking smooth. Cool. So in this game there's a movement phase where everyone moves, like we just did. Then if an opponent clashes with your unit, you get stopped in the zone of control. As the text is just saying. So Aragorn has to melee him. Now, yeah, Frodo, you smash him. It's a long way to throw, Frodo. I don't know if I trust you yet, you're only level 3, which I assume is pretty shit. What are they shooting? Key blasts! Eh. Incorrect. Well, it didn't actually tell me where to go. Thank you very much. These tiles are elevated. It'll give Sam Frodo added accuracy. Well, that makes sense. The downward vector would actually reduce the amount of stress on the arm when you throw. And what am I doing? Oh. There's no prompt. Range attacks are impossible due to the enemy's ability to interrupt that attack. That's a stupid reason. They could just say that when you're in melee range, you can't use the range attack. You don't need to say due to the enemy's ability to interrupt. I don't know, it sounds fucking like really shammy. Excellent work. Thanks, game. Thanks, EA. Use R. <laughs> Very good. Why wasn't that excellent? Faggot. Ring race doing the same damage as Aragorn. That's the wrong character. Oh, I'm sorry. What are you gonna do about it? You can press square to set a sequence of waypoints. Oh yeah, these things. Mm-hmm.
press select. Okay, yeah, the health. Because it just by default just shows your level and the name. But those 2D images, oh my god, they look shit. But on the PSP, like, they actually were tiny. And now I've upscaled it to a fucking 2560 by bloody 1440 pixelated screen. And upscaling is not going to help. The upscaling helps with rendering. Not the 2D images, so I can't really fix that. Those health bars are actually really annoying. You can see on the blue bar, that's the action point one. And see about halfway through the bar, it gets less and less bright. It just dims. Well, before the bar actually ended halfway, the rest of it was black, but I managed to somehow get the blue showing on the end. Because otherwise, you wouldn't know how many AP points you got if you just look at the bar. Leaf of Dried Athelus. Okay. Bitch King. What does he got? Courage of Sam. Well, that's... Hmm. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it makes him resistant to fear. But there's no way of knowing unless you go in the menu. Like, there's no prompt here. So I'm not gonna use it. Ow! Eighty. Well, Sam's fucked. Like, that Nazgul's gonna follow Sam, and every time he follows Sam, Sam's just gonna get trapped in a zone, so... What the fuck am I gonna do? Oh, okay, now Witch King's f fucking... Halfling... Oh, no, that's a melee attack. You're fucked. He's got Dunedain Wrath, which is just like Guardian Strike. Does like plus 10 damage to the average, from what I recall. What? Aragorn. Well, he didn't read the memo. Just murdered him. Alright. Now do it properly. Alright, so... Fellowship, that's just with the good guys and host the mortar. Holy fuck, that's hard. That's hard. That run... I'll do after fellowship, but um... I'm gonna get mad. I'm gonna get livid. Believe me. Around halfway in the middle of the game, there's two levels... That I remember. Where I pegged that little fucking PSP at the wall. Nearly. Hard as always. Much that once was is lost. It began with the forging of the great rings, for within these rings was bound the strength and will to govern each. No, I'm not getting a fucking copyright strike. Screw that. Can't even show a pixelated cutscene anymore without bloody EA barking over his fucking back. Alright, menus. Okay, well that's just where the top, what we just did. Alright, well, I may as well go through the menu. So we got here armor set. This is default. Even though it's showing King Aragorn on the profile pick, it's not actually correct. Andrew's his weapon, doesn't have any bonuses, which is really depressing. Strength. Yeah, that description, it's pretty much the same in Third Age. It just doesn't say the slight influence on your melee weapons. 
So this description's better. Dexterity, largest factor in determining odds is successfully hitting a foe. Yep. That's the uh, same as the third age one. Description, speed. Improves the odds of blocking a melee attack. Yeah, I, okay. Yeah. I do remember Legolas blocking a lot, especially with Haste of the Elves in this game. So, I see. That's pretty much the same. Constitution, Spirit, Defense, Health. Boost the efficacy. Your magic skills, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, currency is gold, that's where you buy all the skills. Yeah, I can't do shit with anyone. Fuck! Give me subtitles, even though I'm not really watching him. Hit Witch King for 30 points. Well, I just did like 132 to him. But that was the tutorial. Are you frightened? Yes, not nearly frightened enough. I know what hunts you. They were once men. Great kings of men. Then Sauron the Deceiver gave to them nine rings of power. Blinded by their greed, they took them without question, one by one, falling into darkness. And now they are slaves to his will. This was the great watchtower of Amonsun. We shall rest here tonight. Ring wraiths, neither living nor dead. At all times, they feel the presence of the ring. Drawn to the power of the one. Back you devils! They will never stop hunting you. He says he's frightened, then you proceed to terrify the fuck out of him even more. Shit work though. Oh, I'm just gonna do the same strat I did before. I'm pretty sure they're all in the same. Arrangement? Yeah. He's probably going to be a bitch king and stay at the back so he doesn't get 30 points of damage taken off. Aragorn, you go head first like a berserker that you are. Really, Sam? You can't reach. Frodo's like further away. Alright, hang on, hang on, hang on. Stats. Let's have a just fucking little C. Strength, dexterity. Wow, well, it's high for him. Melee attack power. Yes, yeah, see, his range attack is like double the power of his melee. And his range distance is 10. Well, he's got range distance 10 as well. So is it 10 units, like, vertically? Uh, let's have a look. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Alright. And then Sam. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Oh my god. Come on, Sam. Need some elbow grease. Wait, does Courage of Sam give you... Oh, so it does have a description. Didn't have that in the tutorial. Plus one move. Yeah, use that on Aragorn. <laughs> oh, this is definitely hard mode. Definitely hard mode. Oh, 
Oh my god. I'm gonna lose! So both attacks missed. And that ring rate gets a fucking triple crit. Yeah, this is already over. And the Witch King's faster than Aragorn. So he's gonna kill me now. Yeah, nah, fuck it. Lost on the first mission. That's something I've got to get used to on this game. Even if you have an advantage, or if it's close in terms of, you know, the units, like strengths relative to mine, and my heroes, I could just lose out of bad luck. Oh! Well, if I go there, keep Sam there. I just have to hope Aragorn lands a Dunedain in Wrath. Oh, I can't even do it. <laughs> oh, shit. He's on 29 health off! Just one more bit of damage. Mm. Ah, oh, nah. Unless Aragorn blocks, it's over. Aragorn's dead. Aragorn's dead. But he attacked first then. Does he have the same speed as the Witch King? Upgrade of weapons. Nice, 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 nice. Aragorn, you just got Morwent. But for some reason you attack first. I think that might have been the game just giving me a little push in the back. <laughs> oh, that was, that, was, that was pathetic. Level 2, what do you have? Okay, so now level 2, there's all these tokens of might, vitality, haste, agility, will. It just increases your stats by 2. It's just a one-off purchase. Mm, okay, move Aragorn, Legolas, Gimme, Frodo, pass the troll off the bridge. Yeah. Well... I think how I'm going to do these is I'll do two levels and then I'm just going to grind because if I don't it's actually pretty much impossible to beat on hard without grinding. If I just do a level and then proceed to the next one I'm probably going to get completely stuck about a third of the way in. And that's that's 100% how it's gone every time I've done this on hard. It's, it's rigged as fuck. Even with grinding, like, it's, you're just a few bullshit blocks or triple crits in the way from losing. Like, I should have probably lost that then on Weather's Hot, but for some reason Aragorn attacked first when he was always attacking behind the Witch King. So maybe his speed was the same. I don't know. Okay, so the new Andrew weapon gave him two strength. Who else? Gimli got a plus two con on his axe. Plus three spirit. And plus two dex. Alright, so it's 20 and then plus the two, so 22. It's not just 22. 
I don't know. Weird math there. Alright, fuck it. I'm gonna go grind weather top for a bit before I do mines. 